What can you do in two years? As the new year approaches and we start planning our goals, think about your game changer, the one goal that will have the biggest impact on your life moving forward. My game changer didn't even seem like a possibility, so I never wrote it down as a goal. It was just always a, a fantasy. And then Luke, my second adopted son, needed to have emergency surgery and I couldn't afford it. If it wasn't for my boyfriend, Luke might be dead. After that, I vowed to never put myself and my family in that situation again. That was in October of 2017. Two months later, I posted a video that would change my life forever. My current balance is $152,677.65. I didn't think it was weird for me to share my student loan debt. I knew the majority of Americans were in some type of debt, so I didn't think it would be that big of a deal. But it was. I mean, at what point in your career as a vlogger did you kind of look at your own financial situation and say, you know what, this is really my most authentic self? I don't understand how me being in debt somehow made me some financial expert, but it resonated with you. Finally, someone somewhere is talking openly about their debt, making mistakes in front of your eyes, crying every month, sharing my wins, losses, and even my income. You were all there. I definitely did not want to disappoint you, but beyond that, you sharing your stories of mistakes, successes, helped me push through those really dark moments of doubt. Because if I was able to pay off all of my debt by myself, that means you can too no excuses and hopefully one day maybe in five blah, years I will be able to pay it off and the day that comes I will cry of happiness because I am no longer Sally Mays motherfucking bitch so here we are one year 11 months later we made it I actually was planning to kind of like get all dolled up and ha look really good for this video, but I kind of figured, assumed that um, maybe I would just get too scared to pull the trigger and now I'm kind of feeling like it's the moment right now, so I'm just going to do it. Um, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, it's that I am going to pay off my student loans. I'm going to call them because I feel like it'd be more satisfying for someone to like tell me <laughs> like, hey, you're, you're, you've paid off your loans um, instead of just like pressing a button and it being done. Um, and I also thought of having Brian here while, while I do it, but I think I kind of just want to do it myself in front of a couple hundred thousand people that are going to be watching this. <laughs> I remember the, the last time I paid off something which was my AES success loan. I started crying not because I was happy or relieved but because I had to tackle this loan now which was what $150,000 or something like that. So it's very like weird emotions for me right now. Thank you for calling First Mark Services. How can I help you today? I would like to pay off my student loans. All right. The payoff for today is four thousand two hundred and sixty-five dollars and thirty-one cents. Can I process that payment for you today? Yes, please do process All the right. payment. So I have went and got that payment processed for you. And would you like that confirmation number over the phone? Otherwise, it will be emailed to you. Email it, and can you just give me a verbal confirmation that I am now debt-free, please? <laughs> yes, you are debt-free. Yes. Yay! We processed and added your account tomorrow. And then um, your account will be in a prepaid and full status for 30 days. Then once it has been in that prepaid and full status for 30 days, you will receive a letter, a letter in the mail saying that it is paid in full. Ooh, okay, awesome. Yeah, is there anything else I can do for you today? No, that is definitely it. All right, well, congratulations on paying that off today. Thank you so much. Uh-huh, enjoy the rest of your night. I will, thank you. All right, uh-huh, bye. <laughs> Oh my 
my god. They did it! <laughs> Who are you going to share your debt-free moment with? Your parents? I'm going to cry. I am so proud of you. I know, I cried already for about an hour. <laughs> Look at my bottle of scotch and have a drink. <laughs> your significant other? We did it! Mama did it! Three, two, two one. A couple of friends. For me, just watching your videos, know how there's been incredibly emotional times where it didn't feel like progress was being made, but you did it. Definitely the person who inspired you to start your journey. Or maybe you're like me, and you share it with everyone on the planet. After all, the only way to help others get out of debt is to talk about your experience with debt. So let's start to inspire others to take control of their financial lives. Can you imagine a life where you aren't living paycheck to paycheck, worrying about when the next check will come in. Still waiting for payment from 2017, and I'm gonna call out the brand, the brand ASICS, you owe me 10,000 motherfucking dollars. Or maybe harping on government promises of debt relief. Or one day, being so financially responsible that you are able to send your children to college with cash. If you're in the middle of your financial journey, you got this. It's okay to have slip-ups and breakdowns. Just continue to remember the end goal. Now, if you haven't started, my Cliff Notes version of the past two years of my life is budget and make more money. Know where your money is going so you can see where you can cut back and make more responsible decisions. But more importantly, especially for me, make more money. I would not have been able to pay off $200,000 of debt in less than two years if I hadn't tripled my income. Everyone's jobs are different, but from my experience, if you tell people you work with what your goal is, most of the time, they'll do everything they can to help you achieve your goal. Whether that's more hours, more money, or maybe helping you find a whole new job, trust that people want to see you succeed. The one thing taking control of your finances does for you is it gives you a certain type of confidence. A confidence that can't be explained, but trust me, it elevates your sense of self-worth. So close your eyes. What is your game changer? The first thing that comes to mind is what you need to start working towards. And if you were waiting for some kind of sign to commit to this goal, this is it.